With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello students, the question is 150 ml of 0 0.0008 molar ammonium sulfate is mixed with 50 ml of 0 0.04 molar calcium nitrate. The ionic product of calcium sulfate will be. KSP for calcium sulfate is given 2.4 into 10 raised to the power minus 5. So in this question we are given that 150 ml of 0 0.0008 molar of ammonium sulfate that is mixed with 50 ml of 0 0.04 molar calcium nitrate. So we have to find out the ionic product of the calcium sulfate. So first of all the reaction would be between ammonium sulfate. and calcium nitrate this will form calcium sulfate and ammonium nitrate so this is the reaction now if this reaction will take place the total number of moles of each of the ions that is of calcium 2 positive and of the sulfate ion so they will remain constant total number of moles will remain constant so we can equalize the number of moles of calcium 2 plus in the reactant side is equals to number of moles of calcium 2 plus in the product side So, we can write that number of moles is number of moles can be equal to molarity into volume because molarity is number of moles per unit volume. So, we can write that number of moles is equal to molarity into volume. So, if we equalize the number of moles in the reactant is equal to in the product side. So, we can write M1 V1 is equal to M2 V2. The initial concentration of the calcium 2 plus is calcium salt is given this 0 0.04 and the initial volume is 50 ml. Final concentration we have to calculate and final volume will be 150 ml of this salt and 50 ml of this salt. So it will be 150 plus 50 that is 200 ml. This is also in ml and this is in molar. So M2 concentration that will be. 0 0.04 into 50 divided by 200 so this gives us 0 0.01 it means this is the concentration of the calcium 2 plus ion final concentration that is 0 0.01 molar similarly the concentration of sulfate ion that will be in the reactant that is equal to the product this is for calcium 2 plus similarly for sulfate ion for SO42 minus we will write M1 V1 is equal to M2 V2 because number of moles will remain constant in this reaction. M1 is the concentration of the ammonium sulfate so that is 0 0.0008 molar into volume. Initial volume is 50 ml and final volume is 200 ml and final concentration of sulfate and we have to calculate. And final volume is 50 plus 150 that is 200. So, M2 that we calculate from here it will be 0 0.008 molar into 50 divided by 200. So, this gives us 6 into 10 raised to power minus 4 molar. This is the concentration of sulfate ion. Now, we have to calculate the ionic product. So, ionic product of calcium sulfate that will be Q is equal to concentration of calcium 2 plus into concentration of sulfate ion. This is the ionic product. So, that will be 0 0.01 molar. So, we can write it as 10 raised to power minus 2 molar. So, it will be 10 raised to power minus 2 into 6 into 10 raised to power minus 4. This will give us 6 into 10 raised to power minus So, this is the ionic product of calcium sulfate. Now, we are given 
the solubility product that is 2.4 into 10 raised to the power minus 5. It means KSP is given 2.5 into 10 raised to the power minus 5 and ionic product. This is the solubility product and this is the ionic product. Ionic product is less than the KSP because it is in the 10 raised to the power minus 5 and it is in 10 raised to the power minus 6. So, this will be smaller. It means in this case Q is less than KSP that ionic product is less than the solubility product constant. So, the answer to this question will be the A option that is less than KSP. I hope you understood the solution. Thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITJ and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.